Hey, 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 <laughs> welcome back to my crazy. So yes, it's time to show what we did with our torrid cash. <laughs> Okay, just in case y'all can hear that, <laughs> I promise you, before I hit play or record, there was nothing going on. The moment I hit record, everybody wants to be involved, but nobody wants to get on camera. <laughs> Anyways, it is time to show what we did with our torrid cash. Are y'all excited? Are y'all excited? <sighs> Okay, so I didn't have as much Tory Cash as I normally do. I think I had, what did I have? I think I had like $300. Maybe, yeah, I think I had 300, 300 in Tory Cash. But let me tell you, I used most of it. I used most of it. Then they gave me, oh, because it was like my anniversary time of being with Torrid and they gave me like, I don't know, 75 or 50 or $75 worth more of Torrid cash. So I ended up using, I used everything all but $25. I logged in two days ago and they put another 150 on there. Sweet, 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 sweet. There's not really much else I want right now. I mean, I'm trying to be cautious with what I'm getting just because, hi, yeah. Hello, the camera's that way. The camera's over there. The camera's over there. Okay, keep going, go on, go on. I'm trying to be cautious because, you know, I've already told y'all that I want to do um, what I'm going to do. And so I need to be, I don't want to just frivolously be giving out. I need to, I need to be cautious. So I'm trying to be as cautious. And with tops and stuff like that, I feel like I can still get a lot of use out of even as we, you know, whatever. I don't know, y'all. Let's get into the clothes. Let's get into the clothes. First piece. So this little, I don't know what they call it. They call it a mm -hmm, sleeve drop. I'm sorry, we have the door open just because, you know, it's like the sun is shining and it's good weather and we've had rainy weather for weeks now and with the sun shining and the, I just want the door open. So the door has been open since yesterday. We haven't closed it. Okay, so saw this. You know how sometimes on tour they will I really wish that I could take my camera down and show y'all what's going on over here. But anyways, you know how when they showcase they have like the model wearing something and you can't find it on site. Well, that was this. As soon as I saw this, I was like, oh, I want I want that. And I kept looking. I would go on every day just looking to wait for it to drop. And as soon as it dropped, I was like, yes, in my basket. I want to say. It dropped, right? No, it was a little bit before Torrid, but Torrid Cash. But it dropped, and I put it right in my basket. And I was like, yes. And so I got this in a three. And I'm glad I did because this one fits quite, like, there's no extra roomage and stuff like that I mean a two would have been too small too small so I got this in a three and I got this mainly for throwing over like a white tank and some jeans or whatnot who knows maybe I'll figure out how to wear it to work I don't know I'm sure I might have something to wear it to work but I just like it and it's not too heavy it's not too I mean I kind of wish these were long sleeve but the three quarter and I can pull it up is still good enough um, and then it's got the little, um, I don't know what you call that, frilly, thrilly, dangly stuff. <laughs> so, yeah, in a three. 
And then we have, oh, I saw this one and it was so cute because it's a sleeveless Harper. My shirt keeps going like that. It's a sleeveless Harper and it's got the like the rose gold, which I love rose gold. Give me some rose gold. Throw it, it wrap everything up in rose gold and I'll take it. But it's got the rose gold palm trees on it. Now it is white, but mm, mm, I like it quite nicely. So yeah, and it was pretty comfortable. This is also in a three because I get all of my Harpers in a three and this is a Harper just without sleeves. Um, it goes a little longer in the back. It's kind of like a high-low. I keep saying it's a Harper. Mm -hmm, I'm right. <laughs> I know my hearts. <laughs> it goes a little longer in the back, which I like that, you know, so you have like a little duck tail. Liking that. This. I don't even know if this was next, but this is what I'm going to show you. So we got like another like wrap Afghani type gray dilly thing. Now, I will tell you, as soon as this hit, hit the website, I wanted this one as well. Um, but, you know me, I gotta save my, my coins. So I put it in my basket, and I think you can only get this in certain size. Like, yeah, it was like a one size thing. Yeah, one size. Um, but it was paired with that green dress with the little flowers on it and i have that dress that's what the model was wearing i was like oh i have that dress and look how good it looks i think i need to get that so i did and then i put that dress on for you guys to showcase in my video this little dealie here so i just really like it and i think even as you can take this into the fall actually even that orange one you can take into the fall the warm fall but this one you can still put like on a long sleeve tee or something like that and throw this over and just take this into the fall this will still get you some good use so i'm really liking that and it gives me the option to be able to wear that dress to work um and throw that on over because it is just the spaghetti type strappy the thin strappy um sleeve whatever sleeveless strappies mm, forget forgetting my words here maybe i should take a slurp That was a long slurp. I was getting dry. Hi, Blue. Okay, then we have this. Now, I think this is a neon yellow. I'm not really sure. When I ordered it, I thought I was ordering something green. I really did on the side. It looked like it was green. And it even says lime, lime. But my eyeballs see neon yellow everything see i see neon yellow i don't see like any kind of type of green but online it really did look green but nonetheless i like it i love the way it falls i think it fits comfortably um i did get this in a three i've been going a lot with threes lately just because of my weight gain and i just want everything to be comfortable so yeah that was that I don't have very much to say. This is non-stretch. Chiffon, it's that mm, material. But it's nice and cool for the for a warm. This. This, I did also get in a three. It's a tube top. But I kind of wish, after trying it on, that I would have got the two. Just because the top, I don't know. It's almost like somebody else wore it and stretched it out because it's stretchy here but it is completely stretched out stretched out like i don't know it's stretched out so it's a little baggy up top um it fits very good down here at the bottom i like it has like that um waistband that like banded waistband so i really like that um but towards the top it is a bit baggy but um i had on my uh cami with it so which my cami is pink so it kind of because this has pink in it which that's one of the details that i loved about it so it's got um and then i took the straps down off so yeah it looked like the girls were falling down to the floor but it was just because i wanted to, you to see it be able to see it without a strap on but Mm, 
I like it. Ouch. I like it nonetheless. You could throw on a, like a small jacket with this. You could even wear a tank top under it if, you know, going strapless is not your thing. But I really think this is going to be so cute. Now, I put this on with some black pants, but I would really prefer to wear this maybe with some jeans. I would wear this with black too, but I would really like to pop it out with some jeans. It would make the whole top pop if you put it on with blue jeans versus the black je black pants. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This. Now, I don't know what I was thinking. I saw this, took one look put it in my basket and said I needed to have it. I don't think I studied it that well. So when it came in, I was not realizing just how pinky it was. But don't get me wrong, I love me pink. So it's very orangey and very pinky, very springy, very summery, very cool, very picnicky, very going to the barbecue, very sitting outside in the sun with my girls, sipping on something. It's just that kind of dress. Now, that when they came in, the straps were not attached, so that was them telling you, it was in like a bag, it was telling you, you can wear this with or without straps. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So, there you have it. It is super comfortable. I got this in a two. So, this is, um, most of the dresses I still keep getting in twos, because I don't have a problem Want, if the dress is flowy enough to hit, you know, the midsection. That's where my issues are. But, um, y'all, it has pockets. It has pockets. I did not expect that when I put it on. I didn't notice that it was going to be pockets because it's so light. I just never would have expected it to have pockets on. But you'll see that I found it in the try-on video that it has pockets. And it's um, elastic-y at this band here. So, this is a very comfortable dress, needless to say, and I love it. And it's just very springy and I love the colors. I think that's enough with the dresses. Now we just have some tops. And I'm gonna save the Whomper for last. This one is a classic fit in a size three. So y'all know what it is. Y'all know this mouth. This mouth is so full of some stuff. <laughs> yes. And this is so super soft. And I was a little nervous because it's a three, but it was looking all kind of, mm, that's going to be tight. This thing is so stretchy and so soft, but it fits pretty nicely. I was pleasantly pleased with the fit. It's a very comfortable fit. Um, I don't know if I said it. I got this in a three and it is very soft. So if you got to go get this shirt, if you don't have this shirt, go get it. I'm sure everybody's got a little sarcasm in their life and they can use that shirt. And if you're anybody like me, you might not be for everybody. And that's why you need this shirt. I'm not for everyone. I know that. You know that. We all gonna know that. We not for everyone. So this is also a three in a classic, classic fit. It's just a tie-dye t-shirt. Um, it kind of has that little swoopy detail in the back. It doesn't go straight across. It kind of swoops. So whoop. And yeah, I don't know what else to say other than it's a three super soft t-shirt. Yay. Then I got this kind of, um, what do you call this? Um, what do they call that? Swing. It's like a swing tank. You know, swing is where they don't fit too closely. They can swing on you and it kind of like goes a little longer on the sides there. Um, this was just one of those gonna run out, put my shorts on and put this on kind of shirt with some like little shoes, detail-y type thing. I, it's very comfortable. I think I would get a lot of use out of this, especially if we're going somewhere and it's gonna be warm. This will be perfect to wear. And what I also liked was the straps are adjustable because it is a little bit baggy up here, but just adjust your straps and you'll be fine. I did get this in a three as well. So there you go. I probably could have gotten away with the two, but I like the bagginess of the three. Last, last, and last. It ain't least, it's just last. So I wanted, I wanted a new tank, white tank top. I have plenty of white tank tops, but I wanted something that was gonna be a little more flowy and so I thought this was gonna be it and 
I don't like the material. It feels too, I don't know, it's got that chiffon look, but it's not chiffon. It's like a cottony blend of some sort. Let me see what it is. Um, 97% rayon, 3% spandex. Mm -mm, it ain't for me. It fit too tight around my gut. It was, I mean, not too tight. It wasn't tight, but it was snug. It fit around the gut. I, it wasn't hanging or anything. And then you get up here and it was just kind of like this little mm, airy out too, too much type of thing here. And I just, it was not flattering at all. Not at all. So, wah, wah, wah. But I'm going to wait because, you know, maybe next year it'll have that flow that I wanted to have this year. <laughs> Anywho, let's go see it all on. You don't mean nothing to me. E-boys like you every dinner. I don't believe what you preach. You're just a rookie beginner. Hang out with boys in the street. Like that will make you a winner. Believe what I see. Why are you wearing gold? You're nothing more than silverware. Thinking you're so bold, but I you are as unaware. Walk up. Nothing to me. E-boys like you every dinner. 
I don't believe what you preach. You're just a rookie beginner. Hang out with boys in the street. Like that will make you a winner. I don't believe what I see. Why you wearing gold? You're nothing more than silverware. Thinking you're so bold. you like that are there any pieces that you want to hurry up over there and get so I don't know when I'm gonna get this video out hopefully I'll get it out before the toward store closes today or you can catch something still online if something interests you that I tried on or even just check out the website today is the last day of toward cash um, let's see I don't know what's next but there will be something next Things are starting to open back up and maybe we can get out there and so I can start vlogging again. <sighs> it's been a long time since I've vlogged and I've tried to vlog, but I'll start a vlog and then I'll end it because, yeah, it's just nothing. <laughs> so I want to do that again. Yeah. And cooking, we do, we going to cook one day. I, I be doing all this stuff. Like I have perfected my tofu tofu scramble, so it's like my Sunday thing. My Sunday thing is to absolutely get up and make my tofu scramble, and then that way I've got it made, and then I can eat it when I want. And something I do different with my tofu scramble from other people. Some people just do a tofu scramble and you know just to scramble the tofu and season it, and that's it. Mm. The key to a good tofu scramble is a lot of spinach. A lot of onion, uh, no onions, a lot of mushrooms, peppers, like red peppers and yellow peppers, and then maybe slice you up some um, vegan meat or, you know, a ve vegan sausage or whatnot. You can put that in, you can put that out and saute that all up together, put your seasoning in there. And oh my goodness, it is so, 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 so good. But the key for mine, I put a lot of spinach. So I'll probably have more spinach than I have the tofu in there, but it's super, super good. Um, I'm actually getting ready to toy with, I don't know, maybe that, maybe I'll film that. Um, I'm going to, I found a recipe. I don't, I don't know if I ever mentioned it. Um, probably about four years ago, I was doing keto. Let's see, I've been vegan two and a half now. Yeah, so it's probably been about four years ago. I was doing keto. And so I made a lot of my own low carb bread out of almond flour and stuff. And so I found one for a vegan recipe. So I want to try it out just to see, you know, if that's something that I can work with too. Cause it doesn't hurt to have a low carb bread, you know, you know, you know, anywho. So I do plan on still, I now have an update, more update for the steps that I've been doing to get ready for my surgery. So I have a lot more information right now. Not a lot more, but I have more information than I had before. So now I'm actually ready to do a video. So I may actually do that video today and get it out this week. I know I keep saying that, but no, for real, for real. I do. <laughs> I am ready to put something out. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoy that. I don't know what's going to be next because I don't know what I... <laughs> Y'all look. I have got so much right now. I don't even have a place to put the stuff anymore. So... Yeah, I, I was toying with the idea of maybe doing like a look book and so like doing different looks with the stuff that I have and then just letting you see out of that. I know that people get inspiration from different looks. I know that that's something that I used to do. Like if I knew I wanted to wear brown pants, then I would go to Google and just Google outfits with brown pants and then look in various outfits and see what people have. And then I would um, put something together with whatever was in my closet that I would have similar. And I thought about doing that because that gives people inspiration and ideas as well. Um, but yeah, that's something that I've been thinking about doing. Um, I do still want to do a skincare routine, but of course I was trying to wait for me to heal because I had a lot of things going on and I just, 
didn't feel comfortable. It's not that I couldn't do it, I just didn't feel comfortable doing it. So we're almost getting there and then I'll do a skincare routine. But other than that, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you have not already done so, go ahead, like, comment, and subscribe because you just never know what's gonna come back. And until next time, I will see you later. So long, farewell, Alfita saying good night, or as you can see, good morning. Good morning. <laughs> see you later.